Dawid, Tomek, Mikołaj oraz Nikodem Pewnie wam się gdzieś tutaj wyświetlają na ekranie Są to osoby, które ostatnio dołączyły do naszej ekipy Do grupy na Facebooku Więc jeżeli chcesz się pojawić na następnym odcinku To bardzo serdecznie cię zapraszam Link do niej masz w opisie Dzisiaj chciałem wam przedstawić najlepsze akcje profesjonalnych graczy Z jednym HP w CSGO Pamiętajcie, żeby zostawić łapkę w górę, subskrypcję oraz komentarz Z pomysłem na kolejny film Na kanale jest nas aż 27 tysięcy A na grupie i na innych social media zaledwie garstka Więc w opisie też macie social media Do których was serdecznie zapraszam ja jestem Ekst i zapraszam was wszystkich do oglądania Z kodem promocyjnym X w zakładce promo code możesz otworzyć swoją pierwszą skrzynkę za darmo A i możesz jeszcze napisać w komentarzu co ci drobnie się mecz między Hell Risers a Mouseports, gdzie w obu drużynach zostaje po dwóch zawodników, między innymi Chris J, który z jednym HP zabija dwóch przeciwników. Oglądajcie sami. Only got 42 health himself. This is gonna be a tough one. Oh my god, he's down to seven. These grenades. Oh man, how are they gonna live through this one? Well, Hell Risers are definitely taking their time about it. Really desperately awaiting a peek from Mouseports, but Mouseports are so scared because their health is just ridiculously low. Chris J gets one. He knows who Bondic is. He's got one point of health. What? Chris J and Lowell somehow win that round. That should never happen. 14 to 7. City kontra Nip i Coldzera na Force z CZ, ką Kevlarem i Flashem. Niby w tym momencie nie ma jednego HP, ale przeciwko trzem przeciwnikom z panu wyposażeniem ukraczować rundę i zostało mu właśnie tylko jeden HP, to jest naprawdę nie rada wyzwanie, zwłaszcza na profesjonalnej scenie. Oglądajcie sami. That Molotov that landed on FNX was beautiful, so now Cold hiding at the edge and he has got a kit. I don't think Nip are gonna let this one go, but we've seen crazier things before. Cold not waiting for the time to run out. Gonna go and pick up the kill on one. Threat gonna go down as well. Gold Zero now in a one-on-one -on -one against Exist. He's got the time for it. Running behind the crate here. Exist has to run straight away. There's a lot of time to run and Exist. He's trying to position himself closer. There's gonna be the straight defuse. Exist waiting under attack. Cold, he's home out. He's gonna get a shot. He actually gets it. He'll have enough time. What a clutch coming out. And Cold Zero equalizing the scoreline for 2-2. Two -two. That's a one on three against Nip surviving on one health. And you just have some players who are able to excel no matter the... Toczy się mecz między Cloud9 a naszą polską drużyną Virtus Pro. Neo został na dwóch przeciwników, gdzie miał jeden HP i popisał się naprawdę wielkim opanowaniem. W sumie, co wam mogę mówić na ten temat? Oglądajcie. The correction trades it down into a 4v4 now, and they are trying to push back in, but there's more pressure about to work its way in from both sides of this one. VP, but Cloud9 are also rotating back in, and they've just picked up two kill snacks. He's running wild, but unfortunately, he just lost his entire team. Neo, though, with the flick shot on the shroud, destroying him. Unfortunately, he's down to one HP. And if you get one of these kills again, it really does hurt Cloud9's rebuy. In the next round, he's going to be playing this one aggressively. You know, he's facing, and that's the first frag. Obi knows to him. Skadoodle's also there on 15 health. Is Neo going to do it again? He's caught so many from this kind of a situation, and that's the headshot. Neo putting Cloud9 in. się mecz między dwoma brazylijskimi drużynami Pain Gaming oraz T-Show. Główny bohater, mianowicie Vini, gdzie został z jednym HP na czterech przeciwników, niesamowicie uklaczował rundę, gdzie sprzedał naprawdę ładne one-tapy. Muito rápido aqui para a equipe da T-Show nesse pistol. Apenas o Vini sobrevive e já vai encontrar três oponentes. Levou dois que duas balas sensacionais aqui de USP, mas ele fica com um de vida contra três. Vai ter que fazer isso mais três. Olha só o Vini sensacional. Já leva mais um e agora só tem dois oponentes pela frente, lembrando que ele ainda tá com um de vida e com o defuse kit e o smoke pra tentar trabalhar, né, mas ainda é muito difícil pra ele, ele vai ali pra cima já Mais um o quarto, que que é isso? E Vini? ele tem smoke! Meu Deus, tem a smoke o defuse pode fazer o ninja, e agora o Nex vai tentar estreifar ali pra eliminar o jogador, Nossa, que round! o Vini, sensacional 5k pra ele o ace clutch do Vini e garante o defuse kit Gracz drużyny Fnatic, mianowicie Flusha, przez wielu uważany jako cheater na profesjonalnej scenie CS-a, jednak nie rozmawiajmy dzisiaj o tym, żeby nie było żadnych kontrowersji. Został na dwóch przeciwników drużyny Cloud9, gdzie miał położoną bombę oraz miał jeden HP. Osobiście według mnie trochę panicznie to rozegrał, jednak mu się to udało. W sumie, co wam będę mówił? Oglądajcie sami. 
personal here, but also Flusha sitting back up inside of the long haul there. He's only got one HP, however. If they do this correctly, they can still manage to pull up this retake. Stewie is going to find Wenton first, and I think he just saw Flush as well. He knows he's up there, but no! What? There's going to be a full peak coming out there from Slemmy, and they just leave the angle open for Flusha. Oh. And now Stewie, he's going to essentially run out of time, trying to jump up there, but Flusha could just play with him now. He's going to sit inside, or even throws the pistol out, and it works! Look at this and he guy, finds one the kill. HP! Nicely done by Flusha, and that is going to be Fnatic's ninth round. That is how you do it. Just toying with your food. Flush, or what a beast play then. One HP and he still managed to work out those two players. And you thought once you saw Wenton.